We have all of our Louisiana crayfish. I love you. My God, bro. Pitching me. Three, two, one. What's up, Raw fam? So today is a very special day. We're actually gonna be taking these beautiful red tails right here. Hi, babies. Hey, let me just give them a little, little pet on the head. Hey, buddy. I love you. I love you. Now, these guys are so excited. You know, obviously, my fish are very well trained. They'll come up and they'll they give me some kisses. But of course, these fish are so beautiful and now it's officially time to take these fish and move them over to that other pond. Oh no, I totally forgot. I wanted to take these fish and put them over in that pond, but hold up. Wait, come here so you guys can see this. So this is the US Postal Service. Hello Franklin, your shipment on crawfish from Louisiana has arrived at your doorstep, goodbye. Oh my gosh, bro, they're here. They're literally here. Dang it, bro, I wanted to take all these beautiful red tails and you know, put them over inside of the big pond, but Bro, that, that might have to wait till tomorrow's video. Dang. I mean, I'm so excited because, you know, obviously I get all these beautiful crawfish from Louisiana to stock all of my ponds, but, you know, it looks like these beautiful red tails. Hi, right, buddy. You're gonna have to wait another day. You're gonna have to wait, buddy, because, of course, we have to go off and get all the crawfish on my doorstep, so come on, guys. Uh, Louisiana Crawfish Co. from 1985. That's their phone number if you guys wanna go off and get some beautiful, you know, crawfish fish to eat I guess they're gonna be devouring this stuff because they love yummy crawfish but like a hundred living animals inside of this little box easily bro probably so come on let's do it yeah, we'll just put that right there for a second uh do we have a knife do I have a knife oh can you guys see in there oh geez oh Pete's okay there we go so a uh, fun fact raw fam if you got oh look that's all the crawfish what is this this is that to like make a soup or something Oh, it is. So, of course, this is just Louisiana crawfish, you know, voted the very best Creole seasoning. I mean, guys, this stuff, let me smell it. Mmm, it smells, it smells like Old Bay. It smells pretty good. We're going to take this. They put ice packs on these guys so that it doesn't get too hot in here. This is all of the crawfish right here. Oh, yeah, so we don't need this. We're probably going to have to rinse these guys off. You guys alive? Look at them. Oh, geez, they're alive. They're very, they're pinching me. They're pinching me through this mesh. So you want to, oh, there's like a little bucket right here. Let me grab the bucket. And uh, we have this little see-through container. So we'll actually be able to see if there's any uh, little crayfish in there. All right, Raw Fam, so these crayfish right here, they come from Louisiana. They ship these guys overnight to me. They have gills and they live, you know, down deep in the freaking nasty weeds over there in Louisiana. They use massive fish traps, you know, to get all these beautiful, you know, little food items for us. You guys ready? So we're just gonna take these guys right there. See them all? Ah, oh, they're pitching me. Ew, get out of the bag. Oh my god, bro. Is there a lot? Oh my gosh. Look at them. Look, stand like right here. See if you could get. That's like the best shot of them. See, see how dirty they were? And that's a good thing. And a lot of them just come straight up dead, just like that. We're gonna give them. Bro, you smell that? Bro, honestly. It smells like salt. Is, is this is this like salt water? I thought crayfish were fresh water. Why is there so much salt on these guys? Oh, oh. Crap. All right, Raw fam. So now it's time. You guys ready? Let's just get all the alive ones. This guy's obviously alive. That guy right in there, alive. Um, alive. <laughs> and we're just gonna kind of sort all these guys out. These guys are fighting. Oh my gosh, that thing's big. What's up? All right, Raw fam, so the water inside of here is already getting a little murky, so we're just gonna keep rotating it out, making all of these fish nice and fresh. Ah, nice and fresh. Now you see all these? These are all perfect, beautiful crayfish. Louisiana crayfish, these guys are doing amazing. All right, bro, so let's just get all these guys in here. Oh, we're just gonna grab all these guys and then start stocking the ponds with them. Oh. Hi, Raw fam. So for the most part, you know, all of these beautiful little crawfish are gonna go in, you know, some of my ponds. 
They're gonna go in here. They're also gonna go over here. You know, for the most part, we're only gonna put a couple, you know, in each pond just because we don't need them that much here at the Rolf Fam. The place I really need them is over at that pond that I put baby jaws. There's not that much food in there and I just want baby jaws to be okay. You guys obviously know the OG baby jaws. We caught this other fish, you know, the other day and he's kind of cool. I'm just not sure if, you know, she'll live up to the standard of baby jaws. But of course, come on Rolf Fam, it's time to grab some of these beautiful little crawfish. Oh, hi, buddy. Oh, yeah, look at those big old claws. Woo! That is a big oh old God, crawfish, man. bro. That thing is gonna be breeding up a storm over at that other punch. Look at his bottom, see that? Look how beautiful this is. So that's a male, you could tell because it has these like little legs that go up here. And uh, I mean, that thing is massive. So we're just gonna take this guy, put him back in here. Are you ready? Come over here, come on, bud. All right, Rolf fam, how you guys doing? So we got a couple koi in here, some beautiful fish, but we look in here, we don't want the big ones, we want the small ones, because we don't have that big of, yeah, see, that one's perfect right there. This guy will get absolutely annihilated in here. There he goes. Okay, so that one's a little bit bigger. I want to put that in the wild pond, because I want these guys to breed. So you guys see, oh yeah, that one's perfect right here. There he goes. Oh, geez, oh, please, that one. Two little guys right there. This guy done. Yeah, that guy's probably, yeah, this guy's out cold. Yeah, he's done now. Watch this. All right, Raw fam, so I think that is gonna be enough for these beautiful little crayfish. If you guys look right here, we got a bunch. I think I'm gonna throw a couple more females, beautiful females. Come here, come here, come here. Uh, that's a big male, male, the big males are the good eating ones, that's a female for sure, that's a female for sure, hi female. What's up big fella? Bro, did you see him bro, he's literally trying to fight everyone else, he's like squaring up trying to fight. But of course we're going to take all these little crawfish and we're going to take them over to my wild pond and uh, we're going to basically stock my pond with a bunch of crawfish. Alright Raw fam, so as you guys can see, if you guys come right here have our Louisiana crawfish right in here because we had a little bit of a drive. So of course we're gonna take these guys over to the pond. Come on. All right, Rolf fam, come on. Here we go, Rolf fam. So as you guys can see, we have our Louisiana crawfish container. We're gonna put right here. So that's a little bit of like our perishables. Rolf fam, honestly guys, what do you guys think is in here? I mean, do you guys think there's a lot of males, a lot of females? I'm not too sure. What we're gonna do, we're gonna open it up. Come right here. Gonna open it right there. Hi guys, how you doing? So let's see if we have a lot more males or a lot more females, because then we'll be able to know what the breeding is like in here. So you ready? Just gonna dump these guys out. There we go. Oh, look at all those crawfish. Jeez, oh peace. Where are you guys going? Where are you guys going, Raw fam? Okay guys, so we're gonna look at the ratio between males and females. Bro, we have so many all the way over here. We can just throw these back. So these are female, female, two females right there. This is a male, that's a female. So we're gonna go, oh, look at the bass. Uh-oh, the bass are hungry. The bass are hungry, bro. So we're gonna take these guys. We're gonna actually put them back in so we can separate them throughout the pond evenly. So we're gonna just take a couple of these guys and uh, we're gonna just see, like that's a big male. We're gonna just throw that in there. Are there any bass here? Any, oh, we just got clobbered, ooh. Okay, I wanna see if I can show you guys these. So we wanna keep the big males because those are the big breeders. But like a little guy like this, let's see. Anything here? Hey guys, you guys hungry? Anything hungry? Uh oh. Uh oh! 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 That one hurt. Oh! Jeez, OP. Is that a bass? I think that was baby jaws. All of my fish are just sitting right here waiting for me to feed them. So I'm gonna actually put these guys back in here. Ow, 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 ow! Ow, ow! Dude, you're crazy. I gotta just get them back in there, bro. Okay, so that's like half, right? Ow! Come back, little buddy. I wanna put these guys all up in the weeds and stuff. Come on, bud. So you throw the rest right here. Let's see what we do. Just throw like a fish I, I don't think they're gonna fish frenzy like that. So there we go, Rolf, and we're stocking the pond already. So we have these little guys. 
We have all of the rest of our little bit of Louisiana crawfish. We're gonna go over here. Oh, but we should we should put it in this saw grass. Come on. All right, raw fam. So come on, guys. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna just take these crawfish and we're gonna throw them right here in the weeds, just right there. Nothing crazy. We're just gonna slowly but surely just take these guys. You know, we're gonna evenly distribute them through our pond. Hi guys. You guys good? Yeah, throw some by the rocks, bro. They like yeah. to go in them. Yeah, so there's rocks right there. That would be perfect. So should I get like... Yeah, that should be perfect. Bro, imagine if these things start breeding in here. We won't have to buy them anymore. We're just gonna evenly distribute them all throughout the pond. Watch your step. Oh yeah, look at this. They're gonna love it right here. See all this little rocks and crevices right there? Just like that. Honestly, bro, I think this is the spot to put all of the crayfish. So we have all of our Louisiana crayfish and we're just gonna throw it right here. You ready? We're all fam, we're officially stocking our palm with a bunch of crayfish in three, two, one. Oh, jeez! Have a good life, babies. It's gonna be epic. So, I mean, honestly, Raw Fam, the goal for today was just to go off and find new places or create new places to put fish. And of course, all of those crayfish are gonna live in here. They're gonna thrive in here. And most importantly, they're gonna breed in here. So, of course, we just made our own little crawfish colony. Everybody! A round of applause because of course we just created our own crawfish colony. I mean raw fam, that was so exciting. We have our Louisiana crawfish. I mean honestly raw fam, that was so much funny and I think it's almost time to wrap this video up. All right, Raw Fam, so that is gonna be the end of today's awesome, crazy adventure. We went off and we stalked all of my beautiful ponds with some beautiful little crazy crawfish. And honestly, Raw Fam, we had so much fun. I mean, honestly, just look how cool this is. Hi, little crawfish. How you doing, buddy? Look at that guy. Oh my goodness, they're flying away. I mean, honestly, they're gonna fly away inside of this pond if they don't get eaten. And I think it's about time to wrap this video up. I love you, Raw Fam, and I'll see you later, babe.